Hi, this is David from Enzo Trading System. Uh, today I would like to talk a little bit about some recent improvement that we did uh, with our uh, system. Uh, namely, we introduced uh, some elements of uh, genetic programming uh, that helped uh, refine the performance of our main algorithm. So I will uh, jump right away to the result first. Um, here on the left we have a test period um, between uh, October 1st and December the 5th. In this case, we were using uh, um, the regular algorithm with not, uh, without the genetic uh, uh, programming improvements. Um, during this period, uh, the value of Bitcoin with respect to the US dollar has dropped as much as uh, 40%. Uh, in this case, um, we would have performed uh, almost 34% better than the market. Uh, which is good but uh, still not ideal uh, since the, phone, the fund would have lost 6.4% uh, of its value. Um, on the right instead this is uh, with the uh, genetic algorithms and this is actually uh, uh, corresponding uh, more or less to our light trades um, compared to uh, minus 40% of the market uh, with uh, uh, the genetic programming we reached uh, plus 44% over the market, uh, meaning uh, that we could actually make a, a profit of 3.6% uh, during this period. So I will now launch a live demo. Uh, this uh, is the visual representation of uh, these results. Um, it takes a few minutes. Uh, in the first few minutes, uh, there is a process of uh, training uh, uh, the algorithms uh, by fitting those hyperparameters to uh, uh, historical data about uh, three months prior to the target trading uh, period. So, in this case here, um, on the top there is a timeline which is not scrolling because we are still in the training phase and at the bottom we can see visual representation of the population um, of the possible instances of the algorithms. Um, each one of these bars represents a bit that could be on or off and um, each column represents a possible instance of uh, hyperparameters and uh, there's about 100 columns here uh, which represent uh, an active population so um, in practice um, the population is initialized uh, with bits with random values and then uh, um, a process uh, very similar to natural selection um, decide which one is the best fit by uh, testing these combinations and combining them and uh, mutating them uh, depending on their performance. Uh, the value of all this is that uh, we don't need to uh, test exactly every possible algorithm but uh, rather we just uh, test the uh, selected few elements and uh, select their um, uh, portion of so those chromosomes of these bits and uh, combine them together until uh, uh, close to optimal result is achieved. So a bit more in detail we can see here for example we have uh, um, a set of hyperparameters in our code. Uh, these parameters they have a minimum and a maximum value in the number of discrete steps that we want uh, to try. So in this case this is uh, parameters for the non-genetic algorithms. We have to be careful how many discrete steps we want to try because uh, um, they all uh, uh, multiply each other and uh, can quickly grow to a very large number of uh, required tests. In this case for example um, we have a total of um, six bits worth 
of uh, combinations which would translate in uh, 64 possible algorithms uh, versions and uh, we can do this in real time however this is often um, um, not enough and uh, we would rather have a case in which we have uh, many more discrete steps and a wider range of minimum and maximum values and this is indeed the case with genetic algorithms that we are now uh, testing in this case uh, if we had to test all possible um, mutations of the algorithm uh, we would have, have to test uh, 65,536 of them which uh, would require possibly hours of testing uh, but uh, in this case with the genetic approach we can see that uh, we are almost near to completion um, so now the optimization of the hyperparameters is finished and uh, selected uh, few combinations are put in play into the simulation of the market which more or less corresponds to our live trades because our simulation is fairly accurate and matches uh, matches fairly well um, what the live trade uh, does so here we can see um, a number of uh, recent uh, algorithms that have been uh, considered for actual live trading this is already um, a refined set that we built that uh, we came uh, to uh, during the process uh, of optimization with the genetic programming and uh, as we test more and more uh, different algorithms are selected so we're now at the end of the actual testing and uh, we can see several of the trades and most importantly we can see here on the bottom right that we indeed reached the uh, conclusion of uh, beating the market by 44 percent so this concludes my demonstration today if you would like to know more about the system or uh, just have a chat with me plus please get in touch uh, through youtube or twitter or whatever else until then uh, have fun trading